Welcome back to another episode of Astros, and today, guys, I'm back out of the pond, but it's not gonna be the same video as always, because I actually have people fishing with me this time. There's Kevin. You guys remember him? He, like, hasn't been fishing since, when was the last time you fished, like? Uh, Pontiac Lake. Like, January, so. And David, have you even ever been on the channel? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, a few times. Yeah, like, yeah, like, early like, on, you had your dyed hair. Like, like, 2019, so. We're gonna do a 1v1v1 challenge. We got one hour, whoever catches the most largemouth bass, wins so let's go we'll, we'll set a timer for one hour most fish wins all right if i get three two one start fishing oh oh that was almost first cast almost well too bad you're bad so i'm definitely at a slight advantage considering that i fished this pond a lot and know all the spots but I'm telling them where to go, but they're not listening to me. So I'm, I'm fishing here and I'm gonna catch some, hopefully. Yep, literally first cast, but then I missed it because I'm bad. Dude, I hate these stupid pumpkin seeds like with a burning passion, I'm not even gonna lie. They just like tease me all the time. They, you just feel like, doo -doo -doo -doo. I'm like, really? Why are you teasing me? You gotta play that meme right now. You naughty, naughty, you teasing me, you naughty, naughty. <laughs> Well, I was catching a lot yesterday on that side, so we might have to go over there now. Really, you just had a bass. Yeah, I'm And you lost it. <laughs> wow. Oh, no. Oh, my God. What is... He's got a big one. That was my first bass of the year. First bass of the year, and it's a good one. Yeah, that's not bad. <laughs> he was literally just Holy saying... Holy crap! He was just asking how I caught a four-pounder out of here. Well, that's one for Kevin. Yeah, that's got to be around... Uh... Two to three? I, can't really I mean, tell. I got the scale if you want to get a weight on them. There we go. This is actually, yep. this is decent. I, can go grab it. I got one on the board and zero for Joey and David. It's all about the confidence. It only took 23 minutes to catch one fish. That's not, not awful. bad. Yeah, but for here it is. That is a two six. Two six. So almost a two and a half pounder hey. to start the day. I'll take that. First well, bass of the year. This is a numbers not, challenge, so it doesn't matter bad. the weight. So I got one. I'll take it. Alright. Gonna let it go. I literally when that thing struck at it, I was. I'm like, oh my gosh. I haven't I I thought a little felt like a couple little pecks, and then all of a sudden just poof. I'm like, jeez. Oh no, I oh I had a pumpkin seed. I actually hooked one, but he came off. Makes sense, I like to lose fish, as you guys know from the recent videos. Flashback. Oh, yep. Yeah. No! Oh! Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah, there's one. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. Dude, oh my gosh, he came off. <laughs> so, what you got over here? Dude, okay, so. <laughs> I have no explanation. <laughs> Literally, the only explanation I have is um, uh, I'm stupid. <laughs> now the, these pipes right here, I probably lost like you can ten see Ned rigs. You can like I, I thought I didn't realize I thought they went this way, but then. But then there's also yeah. pumpkin seed. Oh my gosh! Rip! I, I didn't feel like pumpkin seed on that one. I literally caught 12 yesterday in like an hour and a half and now we've caught one combined which is kind of kind of odd maybe they're just kind of scared that i just hammered them yesterday and they're like yeah nope i ain't biting anything today that might be it honestly because it is a small pond there's one. Oh, yep come here mate come here yes sir. Oh. yes sir. Are you seriously kidding me? Not again. That's so BS. Oh, I think I had, I have one. I do have one. And he just came off again. All right, I can't lose the next one. That would just be embarrassing. They stole another one of my tails. Are you kidding me? So you have 
Are you seriously kidding me? They took my tail. This is the third time they stole my <laughs> tail. And there's one. Oh yeah, come here. Please don't come off. Yes, finally. Got one on the board for me. So now Kevin and I are tied for first. David has zero, so he's last right now. Just a little squeaker, not as big as Kevin's, but numbers is what matters right now, not size. See you later, bud. There's one. Oh, that feels like a good one. Oh yeah, that's definitely a better one. Yes, sir. Oh yeah, it's not a bad one too. That's what we like to see. So hopefully we can land them. Woo! Daggum. Come here, mate. Come here. Just chill out, chill out. I mean, not as big as Kevin's. Probably about like a pound and a half, but this fish gives me the lead right here. Nice little big one. And time to let him go. See you later, bud. Phew. It's not over. Well, there it goes. The timer has now stopped, guys. The challenge is up. But because we like literally caught nothing, we're gonna add an extra half an hour. Cause I caught two, Kevin caught one, David got none. Add in another 30 minutes, go. Oh no. <laughs> so watch the sirens start getting louder. Make a good, that'd make for a good video though, not gonna lie. Oh, he just ripped it at shore, really. Yeah, there it is. Oh yeah, right at shore, I saw him there. Yeah. It's actually a decent one. <laughs> yes, sir. That's number three. I'm taking home the dub here. It honestly looks like the same fish I just caught, which might be true because they could be on a bed. And it is around the... No, it's not the same area. Never mind. But regardless, nice fish. That's number three for me. I'm starting to pull away with this victory here. See you later, bud. Oh, Oh, there's another one. Yes, sir. <laughs> oh, yeah. Number four. Now we're taking home the victory here. Yes, sir. Little dink boy. Oh, well. See you later, bud. Thanks for biting. Time check. There is eight minutes and 30 seconds left. I think I'm secure in the win here with that four to one lead right now. So we're looking pretty good. Although I kind of expected to take the dub, not to throw any shade at them or anything, but I just have the most experience at these ponds. So I have expected to take this dub. So it's not over yet though. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna brag yet. There's one. Oh, he came off. Yep. I saw, ooh. I think I pinned him the second time, so. Yeah, I think I did too. Oh, you got him. <laughs> You stole my fish. No, I, that, that, that's reserved for Dana. <laughs> oh, that's Kevin. There you go. Four to two to zero. <laughs> I probably should have let David take it. You know, not that big, but it's a numbers game. So Joey's got four, I got two. David has negative one. <laughs> negative one. So I'm going to let him go. Come on, take David's bait. No, wait, no, Come on. Some... Oh, shoot. Oh, my. No. No. It... <laughs> Oh, no, why? No, why? No, why? <laughs> what is really? I was just talking smack to the camera that I was going to win. <laughs> and now he's on the comeback. Would you look at that? I think I'm just gradually catching smaller and smaller fish. But, hey, numbers game. Remember, it's all about that confidence. And a little bass. Guys, I'm not gonna lie, I was just talking smack to the camera about how I was gonna win. And now Kevin's four to three. And how much time's left here? Let's see. Would you add another half hour? Yeah, four minutes and 40 seconds left. And it is now a one fish game. And David, he's kind of just lost in the lost know. in the dust I wouldn't back count there. David out yet. I think Easy. He, we got it. He can right. do it. Well we're gonna get we're gonna stop talking and get to fishing. Just... Oh yeah. Oh I got one. Yes, sir. Yes. Number five. Now it is five to three. So that is a much needed fish right there. Much needed fish right there, guys. Little dinkers. Let's go. And there was one minute left, actually. So let's go. Yeah, minute left. Dang it. See you later, bud. 
Timer has stopped. That was an hour and a half. I took the dub here with five fish. Kevin got three. David, well, yeah, so, you know, he caught the fat, been like two years. caught the fat skunk. He hasn't been fishing in a while, so we'll give him a break. But that ends that challenge. We're not going to be done fishing yet. We're actually going to go to the Big Bass Pond and try to hook into like a four pounder or something. So you guys stay tuned for that. All right, guys. So actually, I'm making up a new rule right here at the other pond since I haven't caught a bass under three pounds there. It's usually like between three and like 314 is like the average size. If we catch one, that's just crazy saying that's the average size. If somebody catches a fish over four pounds, they win. There we go. Hands down. And I'm not going to be fishing because right. we need to, we need to, uh, and I'm not going to be fishing. <laughs> <laughs> and I, <laughs> And I'm not going to be fishing because we need to use swim baits there because it's really grassy and we only have two swim baits because I kind of like broke them all off. <laughs> so David and Kevin will be fishing since I caught plenty of biggins this year. So basically they're going to try to take home the dub with one four pounder. So you guys just stay tuned. Well guys, out at the big bass pond here, hopefully we can catch one. Don't really know. We'll see how it goes, but I'm going to have to leave here shortly to go to soccer practice, but I'm going to leave the camera with Kevin and David so they can document it if they end up catching one. Who knows if they will or not. The bite has been slowing down here because of this colder weather and this rain. So hopefully it just can get warm finally and stay warm. It just doesn't want to, but that's okay. That's Michigan for you. Guys, I, I did it. I tied in the frog, even though it's probably not remotely close to like top water season, but that's okay. Maybe they want the frog. Oh, something just popped at it. What the heck? Literally, it was like probably a little pumpkin seed or bluegill or some sort of pan fish that. I'm a little bit disappointed in Kevin and David for not catching a big old bass at that pond, but I think I'm like overfishing it too much. So I'm going to try not to go there for the next at least week, which I haven't been planning on going there. It's just Wald Lake has not been good. The weather's been really windy and cold. It's just not good weather to go kayak fishing. So that's why I haven't been in the kayaks lately. But I'm hoping this weekend I can get out there on the kayaks. I don't really know. We'll see how it goes. But if you did enjoy this video, be sure to leave a fat thumbs up. And as always, stay tuned. Till next time, on Bass Bros. Thank you.